Hey there, just uh, back with a, another quick tip, uh, mixed craft uh, tip. Uh, what I want to show you today is how to um, take a uh, track that you've recorded and turn it into uh, stereo. Um, generally when you record a uh, uh, instrument on a single mic you're going to get a, um, a center channel um, mono recording and uh, what you can do with a little um, of the few clicks within Mixcraft is actually turn that uh, instrument into uh, something that uh, you can have panned on both sides of the uh, the uh, the sound image. So, what I've got here is a is a quick sample of a song, and uh, I've got uh, an acoustic guitar here that uh, was recorded um, um, center channel one single mic and I'll just play it for you and you'll hear it right in the middle of the pan. Okay, so it's a nice acoustic but it's right in the middle and I'd like to in my final mix I'd like to have it in both ears. So what I can do here is um, once I've got all the effects that I like on this um, acoustic uh, what I'll do is I'll actually just duplicate this track, okay? And it's probably best to, to name it um, Acoustic Center, mm -hmm. or sorry, Acoustic um, Left, because this will be the left channel, and you'd rename this one Acoustic Right, just to keep things in track. Uh, and then what I do is I'll pan, I'll pan, um, I'll pan this one all the way to the. Sorry, let me make this left. My bad make this left make this right and what I'll do is I'll pan the top one all the way to the left and I'll pan this one all the way to the right now if I listen to this you'll hear it's still it's still in the middle okay so there's one more little trick that I have to do and what I need to do is I need to to zoom in here and what I need to do is take the sound image here and just take the second one, the one to the right, and just move it over just a tear, or a hair, I should say. And you have to kind of experiment with this. So if you know, if you listen to it now, you should hear more of the stereo effect. Okay, so that was. Let me go back to the other one so you can see what it sounds like. So here is. And then I'll do the, the new one. So you can see it gives you a much fuller sound. Okay. And you could do that with pretty much any instrument. You could do it with a vocal. It's a real, real great technique to fattening the sound. Especially I like it on acoustic guitars. Uh, so you can get that, that full sound. So just a quick tip on how to take a um, mono single channel recording and give it the effect of... Uh, uh, a stereo sound. Hope that was helpful and uh, thanks for listening. Please comment and subscribe and stuff uh, below if you like and uh, uh, thanks again for listening.